Okay, hello again. I had to set up my controller there. I remember that on uh, my emulator, I, I have to use a very unusual uh, control scheme. But I've got it all set up now, because... What do I do? Oh, you know what? First, I get the idea that I'm going to want to put that on. Because I remember this part in the game. Oh, that radio. What's that? Ugh. Huh. I played radio. too much Silent Hill. What's huh? going on with radio. radio? Like I said, it's not that much better, but it's still a little better than Dark Crisis and Resident Evil. Especially the original, original Resident Evil. Oh, God. I hate... What even is that thing? And then the music is all, Oh, God, everything is terrible. Come here, you. And there's no auto-aim. Fortunately, I don't think this thing can kill me that easily. <laughs> I say as I die. Looks like I'm going to have to shoot him. Well. <laughs> Man, it's like these things wait for me to do that. Oh, God. What's that? It threw me right back here. I don't know if I actually pressed huh. on the door or not. Radio. What's going on with that radio? Alright, this time I'm ready for you. Sort of. I'm going to shoot the crap out of you. And I don't even have a, have a logical explanation for what that, like, even is supposed to be. And, um, most of the time I'm going to avoid enemies and not... I can't walk in here for some reason. Yeah, I'm gonna take that. Um... What's going on here? Okay, evidently it's not gonna want me to let me do that. So, one death already. Man, it took me seconds. Seconds. Okay, it took me about 13 minutes. But a lot of that was intro. I'm glad he writes on the alley where, where I need to go here, because otherwise I wouldn't know what's going on. Because Silent Hill can get confusing. I don't remember how to turn the flashlight on or off. Harry will look at things that I might want to take. And as I recall, there are frequently health drinks just kind of lying around. On the other end, I don't want to really run around too much because the game has a tendency to just throw things at you. Oh, God. Plus, everything moves faster than I do. There are health drinks down here, if I remember correctly. Go away! Ah! And when things fall down the classic Silent Hill, See, this is another reason why this game is so freaking threatening to me. Everything can kill me so easily. I'm sorry, I'm looking for that health drink. I know it's in here. Upside! Woo! This time, uh, nothing can chase me through doors. This is still here. 
tomato, but I don't have to deal with any more of this. And there's that freaking camera angle again. And I'm already... Mm -hmm. This game just unsettles me. Come on. Come on, you can do it, game. You can do it. Come on. Come on. There we go. Sorry, I think that had something to do with the stupid MSN thing. Oh, hell yes, I will take them handgun bullets. I'm gonna need them. At least till I get a good weapon. Actually, I think that's a good weapon there. To school. Is Cheryl skip? Hmm. I don't know why he logically came to that. I mean, it could just be a note that got ripped out or whatnot. But I am glad that he takes it down in his, in his little uh, map book there. And what do we got here? I, I, I don't know how he knows that's him. That could be anything. But, uh, I'm glad he feels comfortable in that. And I want this steel pipe so badly, because that kitchen knife is freaking useless. So, another interesting fact, or for being me, is I can't tell what's going on in that, uh, that health thing. I can only tell when I'm completely healthy and when I'm hurt. So. I'm gonna keep guessing. And there's no indicators from Harry himself. However, since we have the steel pipe now... Harry's a bit more threatening. Also, you can walk while you're, uh... Come here, you. Oh. I think if you sneak up on things, it's a lot more effective. No! I'm dying! I'm sure of it. Another lesson I need to learn, but probably no. Oh, why are there so many things? Oh, I hate this freaking town. I hate this town so much. I hate this town. Interesting thing about Silent Hill. Running, we're running, we're not gonna deal, I can't deal with it. Um... Where are we going? No, not pause map. Right. Uh, interesting things about Silent Hill. Where are we going to go? Oh, yeah. Uh, Silent Hill is at least partly based on a real place by the name of Centralia, which is in Pennsylvania. Uh, this is mostly based on the fog, the lack of people, and the fact that the city's been on fire for, I think, 30 years. I could be wrong on that. There was so Ooh! Holy balls. This is quite the issue we got here. 11th Street Doghouse. Uh, so... I guess these ones aren't important. Where's 11th Street? Right, I think I remember what to do here. Uh, I'm gonna keep an eye on the time. Another thing that always unsettled me more about Silent Hill... Oh, God! Is that it gives you such an open area to... Oh, God! To run around in. You are trapped only by your imagination. You can go to a lot of places. Most of them, probably a bad idea. So, uh, did the Resident Evil games gave you a lot more direction. So now we just keep running until we find the old doghouse there. Keep going up, I guess. I'm pretty sure it's on this side. Oh my god, I hate this town so much. There we are.
Go away! Ugh. Okay. See, I... Maybe it's just me because I'm playing this, but I already feel so unsettled. Yeah, get used to seeing a lot of that. I think that might be where there are some secret items or whatnot. Nice quick save system, though. Uh, secret items like once you beat in the game or something. Uh... Oh, I hate this town so much. See you in the third video. This is the first safe area. We'll be back here. A lot.